Hi guys, just a quick tutorial on how to upload a custom number paint into Trading Paints for iRacing. Uh, this is the way I like doing it. Uh, I saved two files for my customers. The first file has no number. This is a midget file. Um, you can't tell because I've taken the template off. Uh, and you'll see that there's no custom numbers and I've also got a file with the custom numbers. This is the tail tank, this is the front. So the way I like to get this done is upload. Now you do need Trading Paints Pro to, to do this. Choose a paint file. All right, so I'm gonna upload the no number file first. I leave it on community. Choose your car, approve description. Do not fill in the custom number panel. I'll show you why. Uh, select an image. I don't actually have photos of this car, so I'm just going to choose anything. Uh, I'm going to leave all this blank. You can fill that in if you like, and I'm going to set it to unlisted. So that means only the people with this link uh, will be able to race the paint. Once you've finished, add it to the showroom. Ignore that picture, like I said, it's got nothing to do with the car. Close that. Upload another paint. Now this one, I'm going to upload the one with the custom number. Choose your vehicle. Add a description. And this one, add the custom number in here. Add another image. Again, I'll set it to unlisted and add the paint to showroom. Now to check if this is going to work on iRacing, go to My Paints. Find the car you're after. Now, the no number section should show up with the car template with no numbers on it. The reason why we do that is if you're doing an official race and iRacing wants to stamp their numbers over the top of your design, if you have the custom number only on there, it's gonna stamp it over the top and I think it looks pretty crappy. So if you've got the no number vehicle and they stamp their numbers over the top of it, it's gonna look like it's meant to be there. And it's worth mentioning, uh, if you're getting a job done with a spec map, so your car's metallic or matte, and you know, it's got a different finish on it, it's quite easy too. You should have two of those. You should have one for the no number and one for the custom number. You just choose, hit choose paint, add spec map, and then upload your files here. And that's it. Happy racing.